Well, hello, good evening, ladies and gentlemen, and welcome to the fourth IoT Solutions World Congress Awards Gala at the fifth IoT Solutions World Congress. Um, since its inception in 2015, as you well know, uh, IoT Solutions has been a, a, a world reference, uh, providing, in stimulating inspiration, uh, communication, and motivation for IT providers and all across the industry, bringing together the best minds, many of which we have in this room with us tonight, experts, innovators, key players, solution providers, etc., etc., for three days of presentations, speeches, meetings, round tables, test beds, workshop exhibition, uh, and events like this one here this evening, the IoT Solutions World Congress 2019 gala awards ceremony. Thank you for sticking around. I know it's late and I know the temptation to stay outside where the cocktails are being prepared was great, but some of you have made it inside, which is good. My name is Jonathan David Meller, and I'm very uh, proud and, and honored to be invited back here for a second year uh, to guide you through the awards uh, part of, of, the, of the Congress this year. Um, my first very pleasant duty uh, is to thank uh, the sponsor for this evening's event, uh, Global Platform. We have Niels Gerhard here uh, uh, on behalf of the Chairman of the Board of Global Platform. So a round of applause, please, for our, for our sponsors for this evening. And I believe Niels will be talking to us a little bit later about Iotopia and things like that when he gets, when he gets up, to the, up to the lectern. And also, we're very grateful to all the sponsors who have uh, provided and contributed um, all the different elements of the, of the Congress uh, this year. As you know, uh, many of yourselves in different businesses, without our sponsors, it, would be, um, it wouldn't be an event that it is. So we're, we're very grateful to, that, to them, to all of them. Now, before, before we get to the awards and the cocktails afterwards, um, my next duty is to invite several uh, familiar, well-known, well-loved faces up here to say a few words. Um, and we, can't, we, can't, we couldn't begin in a better place than inviting President of the IoT Solutions World Congress Advisory Board and Executive Director of IIC, Dr. Richard Solly, to the stage to speak to you. It is a long way. I did suggest the stairs, but you. <laughs> Good to see you. It's my pleasure to, uh, to welcome you to the uh, to the awards gala as well. I think that there's a lot to say about uh, IoT today, but uh, I've said most of it um, most of it on the, uh, the opening yesterday. That is that we're now talking about solutions. We're not talking about technology. We're talking about solutions. We're talking about technology for solutions. Oh, look at that. They left the awards here. I could find out who won. Um, last year, we had 16, 000, over 16,000 visitors. Last year, we had 120 visitors. For, we had visitors from 120 countries, 32,000 square meters of space, 300 speakers, 350 exhibitors, sponsors, and partners. Much better this year. We don't have final numbers yet, but it looks like it's going to be 15 to 20 percent larger. And that's because we're focusing on end user needs. We're focusing on solutions that actually solve real end user problems and uh, not on just the technology. IoT has uh, exited the real cool technology space and instead and entered the technology that solves a real problem space. And we're delighted that you've joined us for this move. Um, I've been talking to many of you over the last two days and it's clear that you see the difference in the sessions. You see the difference, in, and you've answered the, question, you answered the question for yourself of where do I start, what do I do now? And I'm delighted with the session so far, except my own, which was awful. That was supposed to be funny. My session was excellent, but it was yesterday, so you, no, it was today, so you missed it. Um, so thank you for joining us for the awards gala. Um, I'll, I'll get off the stage so that other people can speak and we can get over with quickly and find out who won. I could do it now. <laughs> thank you very much. Thank you. And you, I should have left the 
is here. That was a really bad idea. Where can I hide them? Um, they, are, they are the envelopes with the, with the, the announcements inside. Thanks again, Richard. Always uh, fascinating and um, entertaining to hear you speak. Now, where's... Oh, he's there already. Ever so prepared. Next up to the stage, to say a few words, Director General of Fira Barcelona, Constantin Serriona. <laughs> Good evening, Senor Director General of Innovation and Economy Digital, Senor President of the Industry Internet Consortium, Sponsors, Senores and Senores, as General Manager of Fira de Barcelona, I want to sincerely thank you, to thank you all for being here today at the IoT Solutions World Congress Awards Gala. I also want to thank the main sponsor, Global Platform, that they are here, the General Director of Innovation and Digital Economy of the Catalan Government for joining us today, and also, obviously, Mr. Richard Soleil and the Industrial Internet Consortium, which he leads for their essential contribution to this event. Creo que todos podemos felicitarnos por el éxito ya de esta quinta edición del IoT Solutions World Congress, que hasta mañana reúne talento, innovación y proyección de futuro. Voy a poner en valor el papel de tantas empresas, instituciones, expertos y profesionales que hacen posible este congrés y nos hacen partícipes de sus experiencias y conocimientos. Muchos de ellos están hoy presentes aquí y es una satisfacción saludarlos. Los galardones que ahora mismo entregaremos tienen un denominador común, todos ellos. Ofrecer respuestas reales al entorno productivo gracias a la oportunidad que ofrece la conexión entre tecnología e industria. These awards recognize the best projects submitted by exhibiting companies in key fields, innovative technology, industry, and business transformation. In addition, the best test bed of an industrial Internet of Things applications, application will also be awarded. I want to end thank you, thanking all of the participants and the jury for their contribution to a new economic, social, and technological development and reaffirming FIDA de Barcelona's commitment to innovation in all fields of industry and economic activity. Muchas gracias, muchas gracias, thank you very much. Thank you very much. Thanks very much, Constantin. Um, and to close this, this part, the aperitivo of this part of the, of the evening, uh, it's my pleasure to invite to the stage General Director of Innovation and Digital Economy uh, in the Department of Digital Policies and Public Administration in the General Etat de Barcelona, and there he is over there. Daniel Marco, thank you for all being ready when I call you up. It's fantastic, it's so good, thank you. Daniel Marco, ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> Thank you. Good evening, ladies and gentlemen. It's a, it's a pleasure for me for being part of this IoT Solutions Gala Awards in the behalf of the government of Catalonia. Congratulations to all the nominees and the winners because you are changing the world with the application of these digital disruptive technologies. Digital technologies that are transforming industries in the fields of production, health, utilities, infrastructures, transport, and many others. But this technology also affects the improvement of people's lives. And that is its real mission. Efficiency, revenues, profit are crucial for our business cases, for our business model, but we must think always about the real benefit for the end user and the citizens. Keep it in mind. Technology saves lives, improves our environment, provides greater opportunities for the people. Your innovators, your innovating are facing our global social challenge. Thank you very much for your daily job. During this week, Barcelona 
has turned into the world capital of the industrial internet of things. A global showcase with the most advanced digital technologies. Thank you very much for the organizers, FIRA de Barcelona, the Industrial Internet Consortium, also to all the exhibitors, speakers, and attendees. Thank you for making it possible. The government of Catalonia is clearly committed with the IoT Solutions World Congress because it contributes significantly to the generation, capture, and retention of the talent and digital innovation. This is crucial for this digital revolution. Catalonia is and has been a land of creators, entrepreneurs, revolutionaries in many fields, in the culture, urbanism, architecture, health, science, and industry. Thanks to this entrepreneurial and non-conformist spirit, Cat Catalonia is now among one of the world advanced digital economies. We now have the right conditions and the ingredients to also lead this new revolution, the digital revolution. Now it's time, it's time for Catalonia to become the land of digital revolutionaries. Pioneers, dreamers, visionaries like you. People who believe that the only way of seeing the future is to create it. Just to put the technology at the service of the people. From now to the future, all of you are part of this Catalonia, the land of digital revolutionaries. Thank you very much. Not only have the three gentlemen, thank you, Constanti, Richard, Daniel, not only have been there waiting on time, but they've given me an absolutely perfect cue. Pioneers, dreamers, and visionaries. Um, and that brings us very neatly to the next part uh, of our evening, the main course, as it were. Uh, the moments that many of you in the, in the hall this evening have been nervously waiting for, some of you possibly since this time last year when uh, the cogs first, are there, do we have cogs anymore? Are there real cogs anymore? No, I don't think there are. It's just all digital now. Um, the cogs started turning and thinking, how can, how can we inv be, be involved? The IoT Solutions World Congress 2019 Awards. Um, and as you know, and I'll, I'll just remind you for those of you who don't know, uh, of course these awards are open to, 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 to anybody, public uh, and private sector entrepreneurs, uh, people involved in startups, developers, um, academic institutions, civil society representatives, anybody in fact, uh, as, as, as Daniel was saying, with innovative ideas, uh, with research, with innovative analysis, vision, and above all, as Richard said earlier, solutions for IoT, for blockchain, and for AI. Um, as the world moves forward in the direction that it's moving, uh, as Daniel was saying, we need you ever more than before. So thank you to everybody, uh, of course, goes without saying, but I will say it anyway, thank you to everybody who who's submitted themselves, their entity, their ideas, their, their analysis, their research, to be, to be judged in this prestigious award uh, ceremony, um, because that indeed is, is why we're here. So with your permission, maybe a, a round of applause for everybody who, who put themselves forward to, to, be, to be judged. Um, and especially thanks to, there we go, that's what I was waiting for. Especially thanks uh, to our jury uh, this year, who once again have done a, a remarkable job, uh, impossible in my eyes, I, I genuinely, literally do not know how they do it, whittling down, reducing all of those first submissions over the last few months, whittling them down to, to the, the three in most of the categories, the three final nominees, the candidates for the award, and then of course choosing uh, amongst all of those, the, the, the final award. So let's have a very special round of applause for our test beds and award jury, please. These are the envelopes that Richard alluded to earlier, where is he's escaped over there. Um, so in, in order, it now gives me very great 
I just have to make sure I get my cards in the right order. This would be a disaster. Um, the first uh, award to be given out this evening in the IoT Solutions World Congress 2019 is the Industry Award, Best Solution for Industry. And the nominees, the candidates are, I can read them from my card or I can, I can read them from there. Um, we have uh, Efage um, and Bioservo Technologies, Mencap, Vodafone, and Thales, NTT, and Nanolock Security. So a round of applause for all three candidates, please. Now it's my very great pleasure to invite to the stage once more uh, Dr. Richard Soli, who will uh, open the envelope, the envelope that I give him, not another envelope, uh, to announce the winner of the Industry Solutions Award for 2019. You can open it now, Richard, yes, you can open it now. <laughs> and it has your name on it. You can invite the people who've won up the stage. Okay. <laughs> this is a difficult decision. I, I, I was part of the decision making and it was a difficult decision to make. Um, and I have no idea who won. Now I do. The uh, winner this year is uh, Iron Hand, a reliable tool for combating muscle and joint pain by Efaj and by Servo. Servo. We have somebody from Efaj. Thank you very, very much. Muchas gracias. Merci beaucoup. En fait, ce sont les seuls mots que je sais dire en anglais et en, et en espagnol. Merci, merci beaucoup, euh, IoT World Congress, pour, cette, pour cet encouragement. Euh, et pour euh, qu'il y ait quand même une phrase en anglais qui soit prononcée, je vais laisser notre, notre partenaire, notre, le représentant de notre partenaire BioCervo, euh, s'exprimer pour la réussite de ce, de ce beau projet et vos encouragements. Merci beaucoup. Um, I want to thank uh, the organizers and uh, also uh, all, the whole team of uh, BioServo in Sweden uh, for developing uh, this uh, fantastic tool that will help uh, the uh, industry have a, a more sustainable uh, workplace. And also thank you to Efage, our partner, in developing uh, this uh, tool. Thank you. Congratulations to everybody. On to the second award of the IT Solutions World Congress 2019, the Innovative Technology Award. The best solution for innovative technology. The three candidates, nominees are Elaine and Cartesian, Fraunhofer Institute for Integrated Circuits and the Municipalidad, Municipalidad de Rio Tercero, ICT, and CBOT. A round of applause for all three of them, please. And to present the award, to announce the winner and then present the award, I'd like to invite to the stage once again, Constantin Sereyev. Let's see. I open the envelope. This, this year, the winner is Nano Edge AI. Machine Learning. 
at the edge don't shoot them. Okay, just a few words. Uh, first of all, I would like to thank the organizers for picking our solutions. Uh, we are very grateful. Uh, we are a French company. Uh, we are based in France and in the US. And I guess you all in the room have uh, IoT solutions. And in your solution, you have a microcontroller. And uh, we have developed a technology, uh, which is a machine learning technology that runs inside the microcontroller and that will provide machine learning, meaning artificial intelligence. I don't like artificial intelligence, but let's say machine learning to run inside the microcontroller for learning and for analysis. And I don't want to be uh, arrogant, but this is the only solution at the moment on the market. So we are very happy to have this uh, award. We have been also uh, identified by a couple of uh, consulting companies as the uh, best technology. And we are here on two booths. One, which is the Minalogic Paul SCC booth, the, the French booth, which is on the left of the, the room. And we are also hosted by uh, Richardson RFPD. And I would like to thank them for seeing us here. And uh, I have a special uh, thought for my team here. Uh, they are in France, and they will be very happy with the award. So thank you very much. Thank you. Two down, two to go. I think it's filling up. I think everybody's coming in for the last, for the last few moments of the awards ceremony. The third award of the IoT Solutions World Congress 2019 is the best solution for business transformation. The three candidates are Godreg and Boyce and Zifra. Suk and Zifra, and Tata Consulting Services. And to name the winner of the Business Transformation Award and present the prize, once again, it's my pleasure to invite to the stage Daniel Marco. Daniel, you there? Excellent. Thank you. That's the one. Yeah. Over to you. Thank you. And this year, the winner is Intelligent Mind, Swek and Shifra. We have people arriving from all sides, taking shortcuts and everything. Excellent. This is so exciting. Forget the ramp straight up the start. Excellent. Congratulations, gentlemen. Come a little closer, yeah. Thanks, gents. Thank you very much to everybody. It's a honor to be up here with my colleagues, with my customer here. We have gone to great lengths to get to a very interesting project, I think. Some of you have heard the presentation we have made together, the two of us. Thanks again. It was fun, and I think we got quite far. Thank you very much. <laughs> Thank you for this award. And uh, we are quite glad uh, that uh, you are acknowledging us. And uh, thank you for this opportunity to represent our country here. This shows that there are no any political borders in science area and area of IOT and so on. Thank you very much. And uh, we hope that our AI development 
will not lead to the fact that uh, next year's robots will take uh, the prizes instead of uh, real people. <laughs> okay. But I'll, st I'll still be here, right? I'll still have. <laughs> Congratulations, gentlemen. Well done. Well done. Yes, no robots here, please. Not at least not in this in this job. Not for a while. Not for a while longer. So finally, uh, the IoT Solutions 2019 final award for this year uh, is for the best test bed. And um, unlike the other categories, where amongst all the uh, submissions, three are chosen for the final uh, consideration, and then so one prize is given. In the case of test beds, all ten test beds that are that are showing here at the Congress uh, this year are, are considered uh, as, as candidates. And, um, and the jury just wanted me to mention that, that in this case, um, what, is, what is being judged and what is being uh, awarded uh, is not specifically the setup or uh, the mise en scene uh, here at, at the Congress, but rather the idea, the vision, the solution uh, that is being provided by, by said test pair. So I think we have all ten, yes, all ten nominees there are on, are on the board. So let's give them a round of applause since this might be <laughs> their moment. And I'm just checking, I only have one envelope left and it says Mr. Niels Gerhard on it. So Niels is probably over there, ready to go. Thank you very much. It's my pleasure to welcome Niels Gerhard, the chairman of the board of Global Platform, our sponsor this evening, to present the final award of the evening. Niels. Yours. Good evening, everyone. Thanks for being here uh, tonight uh, at the late hour and uh, before the cocktails. Um, it's very good to be the sponsor of this evening's event and to see all the good solutions uh, that have been uh, submitted. Um, and also, thank you very much to the organizers for giving us the opportunity as a global platform to launch an industry initiative today, which is called Iotopia. And you see the logo. You don't see it right now, but you will see it again when the slide changes. Um, and, and that's an industry initiative to standardize IoT security. And I hope that a lot of you had the opportunity to be part of the session where we did the announcement today at uh, the event. And I hope that you will also, for those that haven't joined, look at this initiative going forward. But without further ado, we actually want to do the Testbed Award announcement. So everyone that is part of these teams, Get ready. And the winner is Real Time Car Telemetry. so that the photographers can get a good, a really good shot. There we go. Team, team photo, there we go. Are, are you all going to speak or just, okay, fine. Just check, just checking with the organizers there. <laughs> please stay, please stay. Yes, I think uh, as is the custom, there's a lot of thanks to be given. Uh, first of all, of course, to the organizers of the event uh, to give this, um, this prize uh, to the GFT team. Uh, secondly, uh, to our partner, Google, uh, with whom we engaged to actually prepare this demo and who's been sponsoring part of the work that we've been doing there. And thirdly, of course, to the different people in the team. We see, I think we're six or, six or seven here right now, but this is actually quite a global effort. Um, our team in the United States that actually originally engaged with Google to talk about connected cars and how you could build data architectures for connected cars. Our people we have here uh, in Barcelona that have been setting up the demo, that have been working on presenting it to you these days, and the people in Valencia that have been uh, part, that have been building the actual uh, technical architecture of the whole solution. So thank you very much. Congratulations to all of you. Thanks, Niels, for sticking around to the end. Congratulations. 
And one big round of applause, please, for all the winners and all the nominees and our jury and everybody who's made the awards part of this year's Congress so special. I personally would like to thank uh, the team for trusting me once again this year for this joyous part of the Congress. Um, I know it's a lot of hard work year on year for them putting together such successful Congre Congress is growing every year, as Richard pointed out, um, and, uh, and I hope that next year I will have updated enough to have replaced my little cue cards, but not have been replaced by a, by a robot, if that's uh, possible. About 100, 400, sorry, about 400 years ago, in his last play, probably his last play, um, my hero of heroes, William Shakespeare, wrote the line, we are such stuff as dreams are made on. We've talked this evening about solutions, we've talked about pioneers and innovators and dreamers. Um, and for me, from more an arts side of the world, to come here in a more technology side of the world, to see those worlds coming together and joining together and looking to better the world for, for all of us and for our children and our children's children. Um, I'm very pleased and proud to be involved in this event. I know it hasn't quite finished. It certainly hasn't finished this evening. Um, I think my martini is ready, so yes, I can hear it clink. The ice is clinking, shaken, not stirred, obviously. So very little left for me to, to say. Thank you for inviting me here to be with you again this evening. Congratulations to everybody, all the exhibitors. I've, I've seen a, a few of the... Uh, a few of the speeches, a few of the roundtables this afternoon, they, they proved fascinating. I promise next year I'll, I'll find more time to see, to see more of those. Thank you to Sylvia for trusting me all my year, and Richard as well, and everybody. Um, as my other hero, uh, uh, Buzz Lightyear, has it, uh, to infinity and beyond. Um, it only hasn't been done until somebody does it. So let's keep doing the things that can't be, can't be done, people say can't be done, and, uh, and hopefully I'll see you this time next year. I believe the dates have already been put on the board at the end of October next year, so with a clear vision, let's see you all in 2020. Thank you very much, and good evening. <laughs>